What's up, freaks and fiends? Ronan's back with another Booze and Reviews. This week we're going to take a look at a band called The Zonoids, who will be playing our June 26th Ramones Gore show at Bar 13 Delaware. Now, if you aren't familiar with The Zonoids, they are from Kalamazoo, Michigan. They are a sci-fi horror-influenced Ramones core band. I would say their influences are obviously Ramones. Teenage Bottle Rocket, The Lillingtons, probably in the same vein as The Jasons. Dickie Devil and the Deviants. If you like Dickie Devil and the Deviants, you will definitely dig the Zonoid. The name, I believe, I'm almost positive because I'm a fan as well, uh, comes from the sci-fi movie The Giver. Uh, from the late 80s, early 90s, I guess. They had a couple of them. Uh, and these were kung fu creature movies with a guy in a, in a, in a suit. Uh, Sentai warrior kind of stuff. Most likely where the name comes from. I don't know for sure. I guess I'll talk to, uh, to Matt and the boys when they come down for Ramones War. Uh, but I'm almost positive they took the name from the guy from the this self-titled album on Hey Pizza Records uh, is the follow-up to their 2019 demo, and I think they had dropped a single or two in between there too. So this album has 12 tracks. Uh, I'm gonna highlight three, my favorite three, uh, the magic number. The first one we'll take a look at is the opening track on the self-titled album, and it is called Teenage Werewolf. Uh, that's probably their first single, I guess. They had a music video for it. Take a quick look at the music video. cool stuff. Obviously werewolf themes, uh, pop punky, horror punk influences. The link to the full video is down there in the description so go check out their video. Uh, give it a like here on YouTube. I'm sure they would appreciate that. The second song that we will highlight, take a quick listen to, is called uh, Arms of Aramon. And if you're a fan of woes, which most of our horror punk people are, uh, this is a song you will definitely love. It's got some great instrumentation, uh, the guitar riff is killer, and yeah, it's got a great chorus uh, with a, with a woe, whole woe section. definitely will appeal to the horror punk crowd obviously with all the woeing going on. If you want to sing along to woes then uh, Arms of Aramon is the song from the Zonoids that you will absolutely love. Moving on to our third song off of the Zonoids self-titled album. I'm a huge Godzilla fan, no secret there, so of course I'm going to highlight a song called Violante's Revenge. Uh, this song has some awesome guitar work in it. Uh, very cool uh, leads, a little bit of going back and forth. Um, this one is most reminiscent of, of TBR, uh, definitely has a bit of Cody's vocal style in there. Let's take a quick listen to Violante's Revenge.
Yeah, so just some great guitar work in there, uh, and, and catchy hook, catchy lyrics. I mean, who doesn't love a song about Godzilla and kaiju and monsters, right? Am I right? Come on. So, all right, so those were our three that we highlighted, spotlighted, whatever you want to call it. Uh, not to take anything else away from the rest of the album, because the rest of the tracks, I'm sorry, there's 13 tracks on this. I might have said 12 earlier, but honorable mention to songs like Innsmouth, which has a super catchy chorus as well. Spheres, which again, you're going to have some more driving instrumentation on that one. Directive Soul Brain, again, more hardcore, uh, a little bit different than, than some of the other songs on there. But, uh, the instrumental Dos Fuertes, uh, definitely a favorite of mine as well. Uh, I love a good surf punk instrumental. Uh, and then also, uh, honorable mention to She's Not a Deep One. That's, a, that's another pop funky song that it's got like an infectious hook that you just want to sing along with, an infectious chorus you just want to sing along with. Uh, Alright, so once again, make sure you check out the Zonoids. You can find them on Spotify and I'm sure Apple Music and all those fun places. But most of all, go to their band camp where you can get their demo and their singles and you can get the, uh, the digital download of the self-titled album that they released this year. Uh, and you can also go to Hey Pizza Records and get their stuff there as well. Uh, HeyPizzaRecords.com, I believe it is. All those links will be down in the description. So make sure you go and check them out. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share all our videos here as well. We're going to keep it coming. I believe all the HPUSA hosts will be spotlighting bands that are playing our shows coming up this summer very soon. So uh, be sure to check out all of the shows and all of the bands that are coming your way this summer with Horror Punks USA. All right, stay spooky, freaks. Until next time. <laughs>